everyone, and welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Uh, today, we are... Uh, what is the name of this place? Gormet or something, I think, is the name of this Titan continent thing. And over there is... I think she said it was like the capital city or something. So we're going to be heading over there today. Hello? Uh, tutorials, of course, you know, because I can't wait until we're 40 hours into the game and still getting tutorials. Right, it's time for your first big hike to Torigoth, that's the name. Around this point, you'll want to start paying attention to the level of trust between Blade and Driver. Trust is a vital resource that you need to unlock levels on your Blade's affinity chart. Am I recording my audio? Yes, I am. So if you want to maximize the support that you get from your Blade, you need to make winning their trust a priority. When you complete a quest, you'll build trust with whichever Blade you're with. Trust goes up when you achieve maximum affinity in battle as well. Affinity bonds will shine with a golden color when they're at their height. Right now, I'd say it's about time we set off for Torgoth. Cool. By the way, I forgot to save on screen last time. I forgot I can press minus to get to the save screen. And when you look at the save menu, it shows that there are spaces for what I assume will be more blades. It looks like you can have up to three blades with you at any time. I don't know if you can, you have to cycle between which one is in combat with you or if you can actually just have three around you in a moment. But I guess we'll find out in the future. I look forward to it. I do know that blades can be a sort of collectible style thing in this game, just from what I've heard. I haven't seen many other blades, but it looks like you can just get a bunch of different ones through different means in the game of unlocking them. I don't really know how it works. Probably from quests or gathering certain items, etc. But we'll see more of it as we go, hopefully. Gonna be honest, it's gonna be pretty hard to beat Super Gentleman Cat and Pyra, that's for sure because they are pretty sick already. And the, like, alien one that the other guy had, Malos, I think was his name. Garante Plain. Put your best foot Guessing there's legs. a reason this sounds Just a lot this. like Guar Plain. Both start with G, at least. Die, you stupid bunnets. I, I still don't understand how clap bunnets work. I mean, obviously, they would just use their smaller hands for the whole clapping purpose, but come on. Dude, this is absolutely Guar Plains. We got those guys right there. Armu, that's what they're called. I think. Some of them are called Armu, some of them are called Arden. I believe I used to level grind on them in the planes, like, all the time back in Xenoblade Chronicles. It was my first, and whenever I ran into these guys in Guar Plains, that was my first, like, time to grind point of my Xenoblade playthroughs. I would always field Arden, it is what I thought. The smaller ones are Armu, I believe, the ones without horns. But basically, I would always, when I got to Guar Plains and ran into Arden and whatnot, I'd be like, alright, cool, time to start level grinding. Get up to a respectable level for the foreseeable future. There we go. I have level 1 heat ready. Can I get to... No, can you, like, focus on her, though, so I can get a side hit on you? I'd really appreciate it. Fine, whatever. Oh, turned at just the right time. Sick. This bird has joined in, and it's level 17, and I think it's gonna kill me. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm down. I did not expect a level 17 bird to show up. So that was a rather unfortunate turn of events. Be wary not to push yourself too hard. Yeah, don't push ourselves too hard. Got it. Well, I want to fight some of these enemies to get some level ups going, but it's going to be a little difficult to pull off if level 17 birds are going to swoop in on us at any time. Give me all this fish. Going to make some sashimi or something. I don't know. What are these creatures over here? These lion things. What level are you guys? Level 8? Okay, I can take you guys. That stupid bird. It's level 16 now, but it's like... It's watching over the world. It's not good for us. It can jump in at any time. The world of Alres still contains many zoological enigmas just waiting to be solved. If you try targeting all sorts of enemies, you'll occasionally encounter one who... Oh, hello there. Whose target icon looks different from that of normal enemies. We call those unique monsters, and they're a little bit special. Unique monsters are much tougher than the regular kind. Even the strongest drivers in Alres often have trouble with them. So if you take down a unique monster, you'll surely earn the respect of people all over Alres. That said, they're not a challenge for the faint-hearted. You'll want to make sure you're prepared if you plan on surviving the powerful attacks they often wield. Got it. So that level 12 right there is clearly a special one. How do I do the lure thing in this game again? Oh. Field controls. Lure with the down button. So I pressed every other button by mistake. Can I, like... Can, I can't get the thing to go... There we go. Yeah, come on over here. Come on over here. He's hitting me from that far away, really? Okay, yeah, well, you know. Forgot about the part where he could 
telepathically throw its attacks at me. Come here. What is the point in luring an enemy if it still just stands in the same location? There, now it moved a bit closer. For the longest time, it was just standing at a distance, hitting me through the power of psychic will. Really could use the anchor shot to get some HP back. Thank you. I will gladly take that. I think I saw two drop, actually. Yeah. Get some really good health. Now we're talking. All right. I need my side hit right here. There we go. We've got heat level one ready to go. Hey, he took a lot of damage there. That's pretty good. I'm more worried about getting heats ready than I am uh, doing really good damage or hitting damages at uh, certain spots. I need this HP right now. Thank you. I also need this HP right now. Thank you again. Hey, 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 hey. Leave her alone. She's with me. All right, we've almost got our side attack and our back attack. Both very good. Oh, it's ready. There we go. Almost got heat level three. That's what I'm trying to get to right now. I should have waited on timing for that, but whatever. Here we go. Heat level three. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Got it. Spam the B button. Yep. Good enough. Uh, stealth bomb or steam bomb. I said stealth. Yeah, there you go. Steam bomb. Get him. Nah, look at that damage. Beautiful. We do have one gauge of healing prepared as well, so that's good. And by healing, I mean we have one party gauge to revive, not necessarily heal. Give me that. There's health over here as well. Don't mind if I do. I'm glad that when you pick up health, it goes to everyone as well, by the way. Very nice. Oh, we got it. Very good experience. Ne nearly 50. I will take that. Definitely do not want to fight him since we had trouble with the level 8. And he's a unique monster. We will come back for him. I don't want to fight two of them at once either. I think we're not quite there yet. This guy on his own, though, only level 9. Agorian okay. Bunufu. Time to take we you down. may be able to manage this. Need to see if we can find a nice small location with a bunch of Armu or Ardun. And see if we can take yeah. advantage of that. As long as that bird doesn't get in my way again, we should be fine. I think that we can win out just about any fight without the bird getting in the way, since it's so high level. Also need to make sure that we time our stuff. I want this HP. She's got level one Aqua ready. Rock Dunk, okay. Got a nice little shield there, that was pretty useful. Here we go, from the side, big damage. All right. This is good. I'm getting the hang of this, I think. I like to think that I am, at least. Okay, wait for the attack. Wait for the attack. Right there. These things are all so bulky. But they don't deal a ton of damage, thankfully. Alright, I have almost got my level 3 ready again. And once I do... Oh, I have it ready. Sick. Time to destroy you, then. Here we go. Do that. Hit that. Dude. Awesome little fire wheel. Oh, steam bomb. Almost forgot. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good, yeah, good battle cry. Oh, he died? Sick. We're still fighting something, though. Oh, there is a little tiny thing behind him. Make sure I get all this first before it can despawn. Evasion. Stop evading. You're only level three. What do you think is going to happen here other than your death? Look, look at all this damage. Escape route. What do you mean escape route? I'm going to win. Anchor shot for the win. See you later, sucker. Look at all this money. Was that like a rare enemy or something? Go on. Praise us some more. All right, that went pretty well. I would like... What level am I? Yeah, I'm level 8. I would like to hit level 10. You're a healer. That's pretty handy. Dromart, I need to remember your name. But all right, I need to... Uh, or I don't need to, but I would like to hit level 10 before we get to this destination of ours. That's a very tiny Arden. These stupid birds up in the sky are making me nervous, man. I don't like it. What have we here? I want less birds. Less birds, more meaty carrots. I can take you if there's no one else around. Okay. Bring it on, dude. Bring it on. Leo Ferris. Ferris were, uh... First of all, the Ferris in the first Xenoblade Chronicles looked more like lions. These are more akin to tigers, I think, or lionesses at least. And uh, second of all, didn't run into Ferris until fairly late game in the other Xenoblade Chronicles. I'm pretty sure you had to get to the, uh, should have done the side blast there. I'm an idiot. He's still looking at me at the side, though. That's fine. Here we go. What was I saying? 
Oh yeah, you didn't run into Ferris until uh, Machna Jungle. Was it Machna Jungle? I think was the name. It's been a while since I played Xenoblade Chronicles. Okay, got me some slack. Die, you stupid Ferris! Give me all of your beautiful experience. There we go. Level two heat. We're almost there. Pick up this HP so that I don't die. Get on the side. Get on the side. There we go. Look at this damn beautiful, beautiful damage. Love it. Get some HP back. We need it. I have to pick that up. Come here, you two HP bottles. Awesome. We have plenty of party gauge as well. Can you do a chain attack in this game when you get up to a max amount of whatchamacallit? That'd be nice. Tear him apart. Yeah, flame wheel. Flame wheel him right in his stupid face. Steam bomb him, too. Get to it. Yeah, is that to our liking? I guess. Dude, Steam Bomb does so much damage. Is this thing, like, weak to water or something? Are you still not dead, really? Get out of here, you stupid Ferris. Stop being alive. You know what? Heat level one. Go. Good enough. Yeah, nice and flame Nova. Easy kill. Good job, team. Good job. I could have done this blindfolded. We are almost level nine. All right, I'm reaffirming or re-advising. What's the word I want here? Reprioritizing? No, <laughs> I can't think of the word I want to use. Maybe it doesn't have. Uh, oh, Lost an Island. Congratulations. Maybe it doesn't start with re. Reassessing. I'm reassessing my goal. Uh, that's yeah. First of all, I'm reassessing walking over here. We're going the other way. Second of all, I'm reassessing our goal. Instead of level ten, let's just make sure we're level nine. Also, it's fairly early. It's 1.30 in the morning. We should have made camp or something, taken a nap. Level 9, weird, peacock, ostrich, horse okay. thing. What, Leaf Camille, Time what are you even supposed to be? We can do this Come together. here. I need your experience. I'm sorry it has to be this way. But I will claim it as my own. With my, oh no, I missed. With my anchor shot, there we go. Juicing the fruits. Yeah, that's, uh... Those are some words that can be used to denote an attack, I guess. Already up to heat one. I'm getting better at this uh, timing thing. Oh, that looks like a very dangerous monkey right there. I do not look forward to having to fight it. Probably is like level 40 or something, and we'll need to avoid it for now, I'm betting. Die, you stupid leaf Camille. What does Camille even mean? Stop juicing the fruit. That's so weird. Like... Is like juicy fruit? You're trying to sell gum? Did they ask for a product placement? If you could turn back to her so that I could get the, uh, yeah, there you go, get the side bonus here. Here we go, now we're talking. We are almost ready for heat level three. Oh, we are ready actually, sick, do it. I do like having the, uh, having these, I almost always forget Steam Bomb, I noticed it the last second. I like having the heats being usable. Hers does so much more than mine, but I am a level ahead. How does that work? I want my heat to do a lot more. Oh, I went down. I wasn't paying attention to my health. Thank goodness I had enough party gauge. HP, thank you. I need you to die now, if you wouldn't mind. Heat level one should kill you, I think. Did not kill him, actually, which is unfortunate, but you know. It is what it is. Back attack will right here. Oh, you died before I could get the back attack. How dare you, Nia? Stealing my kill. I mean, we both still get experience, but, you know, it's the thought of the thing that counts. Okay, time to take, take out another Balufu. Hopefully not get the attention of that Camille over there. Don't think we're quite ready to be taking on multiple enemies at a time. Yeah, you focus on her, not me. Not Demon Head. That sounds anchor dangerous. That I still love Anchor Shot. I'm sure we'll get rid of it eventually because it's a really base level move, but I like it. Where did the HP I drop go? Oh, it's over next to her. Hey, you want to pick that up? Would really be good if you did. Actually, we have plenty of HP right now. Never mind. Take that, you nerd. Give me the heat. Oh, that looks painful. How dare you rock dunk on us. Turn back to her now. I'm about to have my back attack. Turn back to the girl. Turn back to the kitty. Look at the kitty girl. Attack her. You know you want to. There we go. I pressed the wrong one, but it turned back to me anyway, so it's fine. You know what? Forget it. Just get my heat level three. Here we go. Here we go. 
Easy blazing edge. I wonder what the level 2 one looks like. I should try it sometime. I almost got Steam Bomb. I always remember it at the last second. There we go. So much experience from that one. We're still not level 9, though. Are the stupid... Do these things just show up whenever you kill them? Is that why these things are always here right after I murder one of them? We can do this together. I guess. Pew, pew. What a great move. These things are also really good at dodging, it seems. Well, they were at first, but now I'm hitting them with every single hit. So maybe I'm a filthy liar, actually. My bad. Have I been knocked, knocked down? I'm at 21 HP. Hey, yeah. Thanks for the HP. And for getting me up. Much appreciated. These things hit hard, surprisingly. Or it's probably more so that I'm low on HP after fighting the other thing, because they jump in right after I kill it. I need you to die so I can get all this money and stuff around me. Stop dancing. Who do you think you are? I don't want any of this to despawn. I want all the cash. Oh, is it dead or did it... I thought it still had more HP. Did it... I think it ran. Who knows? But we fought until morning. That's nice. Definitely going to take you on. We're both, like... We can a half an experience together. point away from a level up. Come on. I need it. We might be able to take that level 12, to be honest with you. Get some goody XP. Yeah. But I'd rather not test yeah. our luck. Yeah. At least not right now. Because there are plenty of level 9s and whatnot to fight, so we're not really hurting for experience right now. I think we might be slightly underleveled, though, judging by all of these guys' HP. Or not HP, but their levels, because they're all at the level I am or slightly higher. I would like to be a little bit ahead of the curve when it comes to my experience, if possible. Get anchor shot at you, nerd. I wonder if there's a gym system in this game like there is in... Was there a gym? There is a gym system in Xenoblade X, wasn't there? I can't remember. I know that there wasn't the original Xenoblade Chronicles, though, and I enjoyed messing with those quite a bit. More so off-screen than on-screen, because it got a little tedious at times, but still. I have a level 4 heat. I wasn't looking at my heat time. I just saw that it could get to level 4. What does that mean? Oh, I wasn't, I wasn't ready. Oh, this is the one that they tried to use on what's his face. Okay, I see. Who let you guys over here? What even are these things? They're low level, that's all I need to know. Get out of here, you stupid reeks. They're ricks, I don't know. I need all of this, and this stupid little thing is back. Why are there so many of them? Someone did, there was a topple thing for a second, but now it's gone, oh, I've been toppled now. Get up, get up, get up, you fool. Get up and kill this thing, we need it to be gone. I should have just saved my uh, level four heat. I didn't realize you needed to level four. I thought three was the max one. Well, now we know. So we're gonna want to wait for level four mostly, because it seemed pretty strong. If I do say so myself. I missed. Don't miss, Dario. Thank you for the accuracy up. Apparently, I need it. This thing is still alive, huh? I'm gonna get my level four art again, and then you're as good as dead, dude. It's gonna be over for you. Yeah, you do owe me one. Why do you owe me one? Oh, I'm at level four already. Sick. Does it go to level five? Hold up. Let's make sure it doesn't go to level five. I don't think it does. Nah, I think four is the max. Yeah, let's do it. I pressed B way too early. I'm a failure. Whatever, that's fine. Look at this damage. It hits in an area, too. I love that. You're still alive, huh? If I hadn't messed up that one hit, then you'd be dead, I bet. She's not dead. No, she was just top. There we go. All right, you got to get out of here because you're low on HP. I thought I was attacking the little red thing at first, but no, it's this guy. Die, you stupid creature. Side attack, side attack. Here we go. You're out. No, you're still alive. Never mind. I lied. Please die, though. Thank you. This thing is still full of health, really? How have you not been hit yet? You know what? Let's see it. Level 2 heat. I can't believe I hit that. I thought I hit it way too early, but I did not. I think it was trying. It said escape route. I think it tries when it gets low on HP. It tries to run away, but we killed it in time. We got a level up off that, right? Surely. Yeah, level nine. That's what I'm talking about. Level eight for Nia. Sick. All right. How do, you're level 13. I'm not even going to mess with you. This level eight bunnet, though? Oh, it's going down. It is on with this bunnet. Give me your experience. I deserve it. I called dibs on it. That means it's mine. That's how the world works. 
We just decide everything by dips.